Well, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Nikolai Espresso, and welcome back to another video here today on the channel. What you're looking at right now is, in my mind, perhaps one of the best calling cards in Infinite Warfare, and is a challenge that you can't see right off the bat. It's one of the ones that is hidden away deep within the depths of the challenges, but this Spec Ops challenge, no idea what I'm doing, is probably one of the more easier ones on the Spec Ops list, but it yields a pretty awesome calling card as a result as well, as well as a nice little XP bonus. But that said, we're going to be showing you guys how to get the no idea what I'm doing challenge here with this one and the best class setup to do so here with it giving you guys some little tips and ultimately kicking off a little series I want to do here in letting you guys see every single progression that I do with these spec ops calling cards and challenges as well as giving you guys the best tips and explanations on how to do it for yourself so that said if you guys do enjoy the video make sure you drop a like down below and of course if you guys are new to the channel make sure you guys subscribe and stay up to date with everything infinite warfare modern warfare mastered and of course call of duty in general so this challenge no idea what I'm doing is a little bit different and honestly I wouldn't have been able to attain it yet because I'm not as high a rank as needed but it is dealing with the hailstorm handgun pistol whatever you want to classify it as in the secondary weapons category but thankfully thanks to infinity ward and the hailstorm epic weapon drop we got yesterday I was able to use it here with this and the challenge itself is to kill 100 enemies using the hailstorm with an optic akimbo and then quick draw naturally the name sounds pretty fitting here because when are you ever gonna need an optic on the akimbo Akimbo. The Akimbo is rather interesting as well in terms of mobility properties too, and Quick Draw is definitely something that, I mean, I run on everything, but it's still kind of an odd combination. So the no idea what I'm doing challenge is just this thrown together mixture of attachments for the Hailstorm pistol, and as a result, it is something that not many people will do unless you know of the challenge specifically. Now, if you're going to go for this, I would heavily recommend against core in any way, shape, or form. The Hailstorm is not the greatest in terms of damage whenever it comes to core, but whenever you have Akimbo on there and it makes it hip fire only and it's something where the spread is a lot larger, unless you're point blank and put two bursts into them of each weapon, you're probably not going to get the kill off. So it's something that hardcore is the way to go here with this one specifically. And if you guys like your KD, if you like having your sanity, this one probably once again isn't the best for you, but in the grand scheme of spec ops challenges, it still rather is on the easier side here with this. But as with other weapon challenges, it just comes down to then kills here with this. It's not anything that we have to get a certain amount in a certain game. You don't have to string anything together. You don't have to do anything too crazy. Just play a couple of games with this and you'll be able to do it in no time. I think I did this in four, maybe five games of hardcore. I played TDM, so it might have taken a little bit more time in terms of games than if I were to say play Domination maybe, but that is really all up to the user and how they utilize their time to get this done. But regardless, you can get this one done in about an hour, maybe two hours at the very most. That said, once you jump into a hardcore game, what kind of class should you be running here with this? Well, obviously you should have the Hailstorm, whether it be an epic variant or a base variant, whatever it is. You have to have some sort of optic, quick draw, and then of course a Kimbo here on the Hailstorm for it to count and register as kills for the challenge. My personal preference would be the Elo because it restricts your view the least. It takes up the least amount of area on your weapon with this. And then of course, once again, quick draw and a Kimbo. But in terms of perks, that is where it really comes down to it. I run Ghost dexterity so you can reload faster and of course ghosts hide you from all UAVs which in hardcore is massively important scavenger you do run out of ammo rather quickly if you decide to stay alive granted you could probably trade that out for tracker if you want it that's what I've been running alternately here with this but scavenger I kind of came back to and then the most important perk out of all of this and I guarantee you it will help you get this so much faster is you need to have gung-ho for your third tier perk that is something where I had pinpoint previously so I could see where people were if I hit them with anything or if they hit me. But in hardcore, once again, that's almost rendered useless because it's something where one shot is a kill almost all of the time unless the damage property is very minuscule and it's at range. But that said, when you're running with akimbo weapons, it's not something where you can easily stop and shoot. You need to actually come to a standstill because the animation of you running moves both those weapon models. So the thing that makes this really important with Gung Ho is that you don't have to stop running. You can just keep sprinting and you'll shoot still with this. So that allows you to have that extra step up, which in hardcore, once again, is absolutely massive and is something that is definitely needed here with this. I started the first game out here without this and I decided to change it up because I thought it would definitely be something that helped and I massively jumped up in terms of the pace that I was on here to get it. 
Once again, it's not something that is extremely hard, but whenever you can cut out a good game, game and a half of this and get the challenge here as a result, it definitely is worth it in my opinion. But that said, that is really my best tips here for this one. This one was a little bit more easier on the side of Spec Ops challenges once again. It doesn't require too much in terms of massive tips and helps here with it. It basically just tells you a little bit of a class setup to get this one since it is kill based. The other ones, there's definitely gonna be some things that I'm probably gonna need to go into super amount of detail here for you guys to get you guys this very easily, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this. Once again, this Spec Ops challenge, 100 kills with the Hailstorm Akimbo with an optic and quick draw equipped. The rest of the class does not matter. Make sure you go for hardcore here with it. Core is going to give you definitely some problems if you try and do it in there, but that is going to do it for this little Spec Ops tutorial with this. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. That said, if you guys did, make sure you drop a like down below. Leave your thoughts down there in the comment section down below. Do you guys want to see a continuation of the series? I think I'm gonna do that here with this, but just want to make sure you guys are totally cool with it here But make sure you guys subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with everything infinite warfare And of course modern warfare mastered and everything call of duty and finally if you guys want to follow me over on Twitter That is the best place to do so I'm literally always on Twitter So if you guys want to talk a bit over there, just follow me stay connected link is down there in the description But thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Nicole. I'll see you guys later. Take care and peace